Hey guys, welcome back to Mariah Diane's Nursery. I'm Marissa, Mariah Diane's mother, and I'm on here with one of my twins. Um, currently, I, we have two sets of twins, and these are the Vito twins. Uh, I favor the boy for whatever reason, but um, to carry two toddlers out um, at one time is like crazy. Mariah had all her stuff in her arms, so I just grabbed one of them. <laughs> so I am on here just to talk a little bit about the show and then I'll put up the rest of the pictures and videos and then I'll be done with the show for those who is tired <laughs> of hearing about the show. But a lot of people, you know, like to hear about it because they want to go in the future or just, you know, different people's appear opinions. So today I'm talking about traveling, not just to the show, but to anywhere um, by flight, okay? Traveling with reborns um, in the car is so much easier than traveling with them by flight, okay? So on my way to the, oh, let me introduce him again for those who don't know. This is my big boy, Mason. I was about to say baby Mason, because you guys know I always put baby in front of my, <laughs> my, uh, reborn names so yeah this is mason and he has a twin madison they're the veto sculpts um by laura tuzio ross who is one of my favorite sculptors now and i had the chance to meet her in person her her daughter and i believe her son um were all three at the show and yeah i i went into their booth and met them so yeah um i absolutely adore this baby and his artist is lanice at bnc reborns okay i was getting mixed up because the reborns are nursery, you know, yeah, so that's why I pause. But anyway, um, traveling with these guys, um, I've never traveled with a toddler, so I can't tell you that other than by car, by flight. Um, I learned this time because we had both vinyl and, um, who love elephants like me. <laughs> we have both vinyl. He's actually looking at the camera. That is so good. <laughs> um, we have both vinyl and silicone coming with us. And so um, I wanted to see which one is better to uh, fly with. I would say silicone because the testing... They're going to test all the dolls. They are. Um, the silicone, the testing was basically, in one airport, it was just like they wanted to see. You know what I mean? Peeking in. They kind of took the um, blanket off the face to see, okay, yeah, it is a silicone baby. It's made of all silicone, so nothing's trapped in there, or you can see it on the x-ray thingy. Um, so that was leaving out of um, Columbus. They were just like, yeah, that's what that is. Okay, cool. But they did check. It did not just go down the belt it actually separated and went over for a review okay so what i would say with that is make sure that you are there in enough time to um get that check and it only take like five minutes but um 
and I didn't miss my flight because of that. I missed my flight because of the long line and I didn't check in early. So check in early, just in case it's a long line. It's never a long line when I fly through uh, Columbus, but I guess because it was close to a holiday, got me. So it was too late for me to check in um, at the kiosk or online. So um, they just rebooked me after seeing that long line. I was like, okay, cool, whatever. So anyway, so the silicone at Columbus went by good. When I was coming back from, uh, where do we go? North Carolina, they did take this little um, wand and go over the silicone. They actually unwrapped the silicone made sure that it was all silicone, although they can see that on the thing. And then they took a wand. So I guess it depends on the person um, and the airport. Okay, fair enough. I had enough time for them to do whatever they wanted to do. And I did notice them trying to call people over to see, come see this. <laughs> Because I had baby Malcolm and baby uh, Zachariah come over and see how realistic these babies look. And, you know, some people were like, oh, wow. And then some people were like, this is crazy. This is scary, you know. But it is what it is, right? I was not offended by it. I was not, you know, I'll still fly with my babies. Um, now her vinyl, Mariah took um, her baby Sam by Miss Elaine uh, Montgomery and the vinyl took, a, the testing took a little more time than a silicone, okay, because of the glass beads inside, I believe, or the sand, whatever it's um, stuffed with. Um, so every time they're going to check those because it could be different stuff inside of the baby dolls, okay? Now, they were gentle. I did tell them with the silicone and with the vinyl, just make sure you're gentle. You hold them like they're real babies and all of that. They're very expensive dolls, and I don't want anything to happen to them. And the lady was respectful. The man was respectful and did just that. So they took like this little liquid, put it on a, um, what is it? Like a gall and then um, like rubbed it down. I don't know how they test that. I don't know if it shows up a different color. It's probably something that they have to look into even more, <laughs> but yeah. That's what they did, and um, the baby was fine. You know, they didn't rub it on the skin. Um, I think he actually had full clothes on just for this test. So that's another tip. Make sure you put on, you don't want to have his skin exposed so much. Um, they may even zip it down to look at the skin, but you know, we wait like, his arms is weighted so it has the same stuff that he has in his body um in his arms so they do have to uh test it so if i was taking him i would put him on a long sleeve shirt so when they rub it down and they just do it over the cloth and over the cloth body um that it won't you know make any marks i don't know what that chemical is has to be a powerful clip i mean chemical powerful chemical to um be doing tests on different stuff right so okay guys that is all i wanted to jump on here and say when traveling with your babies make sure you have enough time um because they will be tested but more and more, they are seeing um, these reborn dolls. So they're aware, most people are aware, but not all, 
um, they're always kind of shocked at what they'll find. But some people kept saying, oh, this is like the third time I've seen somebody traveling um, with these dolls. And I was telling them like, hey, we had a doll show. So, and this was in North Carolina. I said, you'll see more and more um, coming home with, you know, the dolls. So just like mine, be gentle and all of that so that the mommies are not upset because we pay a lot of money for these dolls. Okay. <laughs> so that was all, guys. I just wanted to jump on here, show my big boy. He is big. If you ever was, I think they're a sold out kit now. I'm not sure. They may still have some vetoes. But he's a big baby he's my big boy this is a size 18 so he's in a size 18 look at him shorts <laughs> he got us uh, some little cute shorts he got a nice little bomb bomb she weighted him really good again that's lanice at bnc nursery and that's my big boy that's maybe mason that's my big boy Mason. And he got on his little sandals. Now, guys, again, if you're looking at this kit, you need to know what size. Because I did not know. Okay, so this is uh, Tommy ba Bahama. Tommy Bahama brand. Um, I believe I got these from Marshall's. Or TJ Maxx, Tommy Bahama brand. 12 to 18 month kids. Tommy Bahama kids is the brand. And then it's a 12 to 18 month <laughs> toddler size. Um, but yeah, it fits him really good. Um, in sizes, I do like a four. I think the five is too big, but I do like a little, a four and it fit the girl. Her fives was too big. It still looked fine, but you know, I like them to fit and not be like a big shoe. I don't know. <laughs> All right, guys. Peace in your mind. Love in your heart. Enjoy throughout your day. Hey, happy 4th of July. Enjoy your family. I am here um, at the office for about two more hours just to um, do some paperwork. But then I'm going to my family reunion. I got to get myself together. Go to my family reunion and then... Um, I think that's it for today. I think that's it. We do have a funeral tomorrow to bury one of my cousins, but yeah. All right, guys, peace, peace in your mind. Love in your heart. Look how cute he is. Enjoy throughout your day. Bye, guys.